Thanks. Okay, here we go. The princess and the pea. Once upon a time, in a magical kingdom. What, what is that? Tell me, what, what is that? Lipstick. Lipstick. Where did you, did you, you got that from Natalie's purse? You took that out of Natalie's purse? Captain Stottlemyre, please. Well, could you, could you have him call Adrian Monk as soon as possible? Tell him it's very important. Yes, tell him I think I know who kidnapped Daniel Carlyle. Thank you. Okay, shall we read another story? Um, yeah. Once upon a time, in a kingdom called San Francisco, there lived a brave little prince, and his name was Tommy Grazer. Tommy lived with the wicked king and queen. The queen was very greedy. She loved gold, and she wanted more and more. The queen had a plan. She would find a young fiddler from a wealthy family and kidnap him and hold him for ransom. They locked the fiddler in a dungeon. The fiddler's family was very sad. They would do anything to get him back. The wicked king and queen needed to prove that they were serious, so they chopped off the fiddler's finger and planned to leave it in the park. But Prince Tommy was very brave and very smart. He liked to reach into ladies' purses. He reached into the queen's purse and he grabbed the finger. That's where you found it, isn't it? Then Tommy made a new friend named Mr. Monk. Mr. Monk remembered something that the wicked queen said. The kid found a pinky. It's no big deal. How did she know the missing finger was a pinky? The police never released that information. And then the most wonderful surprising thing of all happened. Mr. Monk discovered that he loved that little prince. But he also realized the little prince could never live happily ever after. If he stayed at Mr. Monk's house. Because Mr. Monk can barely take care of himself. So. They're gonna have to say goodbye.